So what mistake am I making, Dr. T? What mistakes am I making? The first mistake is you are doing social media all wrong. Okay, I got three people raised their hand. Yes, two. Okay, perfect. You're doing social media all wrong. Your offer, your offer is not offering. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny to me. The offer isn't offering. I am going to coin that. I'm going to make that a phrase. Your offer isn't offer offering. And the last thing is you have nowhere for interested people to go. Let's move on. So let me break it down, right? Your social media. A lot of us, we love to hate it. We hate it. Like, especially when it comes to our business, it stresses us out. What do I post? What do I do? What do I say? This isn't working. I'm posting five, six, seven times a day. It's just not working. And I'm telling you that the first thing that I want you to do and evaluate is looking at your profile and how a lot, a lot, a big mistake that you're making is your profile is not set up properly. And I'm going to show you through an example. So if you can see this example here, right? So I have the business name is Healthy Gold Diggers Body Bar, right? That second line that's bolded where it says Tallahassee Fat Loss Weight Loss a Clinic, that is a searchable, searchable part on Instagram. So a lot of us have our our name there again, Healthy Gold Diggers Body Bar or Slay's, Slay Slay, I don't know. <laughs> um, or we have Lazy Curve there, there in that bolded part again. And it's literally just a duplication. So what you should have there is the city that you're in, right? What you do. So I help with fat loss. If you help with weight loss, if you do skin tightening, if you do lashes, if you do facials, what do you do there? Like things that you know people will search because if someone in this area of Tallahassee, if someone put in Tallahassee weight loss on Instagram, my page is going to come up, right? If someone put Chicago and um weight loss if if you have that in your bolded area because your city then you're going to pop up and so that's how people find you another thing now is let me go back who do you help and what do you do who do you help and what you do needs to be in lay terms and I say lay terms I mean like a, a fourth or fifth grader, definitely a sixth grader, not beyond should really understand what you do. So in this example that I have, what you what you do is you'll lose up to 10 inches of fat in just 30 days. It's all natural, non-medical, no downtime, same day results. That's very clear. So when someone goes to my profile, it's not saying cavitation, skin tightening. Skin tightening is okay because that's that's understandable. Cavitation, radio frequency, wood therapy. The people don't know what you're talking about. And so it's just there and it's common. A lot of people have it, um, their profiles that way, but that's not what it should say. Who do you help? And what do you do? So if you're taking notes, that first line right up below your photo needs to include your city. Something that you do because, because most of us are, are doing body contouring, then I wouldn't even put body contouring there. What's the outcome, right? What is the outcome that people get? So your city, the outcome is you'll have some fat loss, weight loss, lose fat whatever you want to say but what's the outcome then the next thing is what do you do and who do you help so if it's you help women lose you know whatever you do that that what that's what needs to be in the next line right and you want to separate it by some type of emoji so here i i use hearts i use hearts here um some not every emoji is is approved or allowed but 
pick an emoji that Instagram will let. Well, that was back a while ago, so it may have changed. But, you know, separate each line through an emoji. All right. The next thing is your link. So a lot of us are just sending people to our website for them to book or book, get lost and, and leave. And where you sh what you should actually be doing is sending people, well, let's just say this. If you're set up as a creator or a business, you already have a book now button that you can put here. So if you're using one of the common booking systems, you already have that and you don't need it. So you don't need your booking link here again. For you to get to the next level, what you should have here is some type of tree. And a tree, and I should have put an example here. If someone needs me to do an example at Q&A, just let me know, and I'll pull up an example. But what should be here is link, a link tree that says, okay, you know, different buttons that they can choose that'll take them exactly where they want to go. All right. Okay. So I will save questions to the end just so that I can get to the presentation. All right, the next thing that a lot of us are missing out on is that, just a second, you don't have pinned posts. So now Instagram has the feature where you can pin, and TikTok, they all have them, where you can pin a post to your, the top of your feed, right? So when people go on your page, they can, let me move this up here, they can literally see like your top three things and let me go back so that I can show you what's happening but this video is just showing you how to pin a post because I get a lot of people who you know are really unfamiliar with social media and so they're like, okay, you told me to do this, but how? And I'll post this video in the group, but this is literally how you do it, right? So whatever you post it, all you have to do on Instagram, go to your home button, click the three dots of your post and boom, pin to your profile and you can pin up to three. So that is, the first step, making sure, first mistake, make sure that your profile is set up properly. Make sure that you have who you help, what you do, and that line right below your photo should not have your name again. It shouldn't have like random stuff. It definitely needs to have your city because people find you that way and it needs to have the outcome of what your services is. So what do you do? You help with fat loss. You help with weight loss. If you do lashes, um, you can have that there, but then you can put, yeah, you can have lashes there, facials, if you do massage, you can put that there. There's so many characters that you can have, but that is what you need. All right, 